Hi, Sergio. Hey, Bob. Well, here we are looking at a modifier for one of the brand new SL one fifties. Really? This is an Aperture Lantern. Okay. And uh, these are very popular. Okay. A lot of independent filmmakers, video makers, use these things to simulate ambient light. Awesome. Now you can turn ambient light up pretty high. Yeah. Right? We already unboxed it. Yes, we did. Oh, oh, okay. So here's your first item, and it has English and Chinese. Uh, Aperture oh. Lantern User Manual. Okay. Now, I've never assembled one of these, but let's see what it entails. Sure. Oh, You've yeah. never done this before? Not with this particular brand uh -huh. and this particular style. I usually use Octavances. Whoa. Oh, wow. Okay, so that's the speed ring that connects to, to the, light. the light. And it's, okay. again, a Bowens S-mount. Okay. All right. We figured something out here. <laughs> Check that out. So you... You Take have it to, off, yeah. Oh, and then okay. You can clip it in there. Yeah, the hook's in there really nice. Wow. Okay. That's really nice. That is nice. Okay. What you want to do is obviously don't take. You want to leave everything kind of intact. Yeah. And then you want to be able to move this thing down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Push it down. Yes, but you gotta get it into whoa. those. Oh, there we go. Hey, pretty spiff. Wow. Okay, so now we're going to put this on a light and demonstrate it. Ah, so you want to yeah. take that off, right? Yes, we have to take off the, uh, again, just a tab and a twist. Maybe that's why they call it an S-mount, because you can huh, twist maybe. it off. Yeah. All right. Okay. Nope, there we go. All right. Go. So it did lock on. It locked on fine. Yoke comes down great. Is this in the frame? LPM has purchased this. It'll make everybody's life a lot easier. And uh, in my opinion, you can never have too many lights. 